Hey everyone, Kara Prepper here. That time of the year again, we're planting tomatoes and what plants to choose from? Well, I've decided to go with one here. This is a brandy wine, it's an heirloom. Um, and if you don't know about heirlooms, I'll tell you in a minute. Then we have over here, we have the, um, the, we have the mortgage lifter tomato, it's an heirloom. And then over here we have the lemon boy and then uh, Jetstar. Uh, the seeds are what make heirloom tomato an heirloom tomato. They are passed down from season to season taken by farmers from the tomato plants that produce the best fruit. This process allows farmers to select for certain desirable traits like juiciness, size, shape, and color. It's just a little added note there in case anybody didn't know. So, at any rate, uh, I'm limited for garden space around here, as you can see. I, uh, over here I have uh, early girl tomatoes. I plant them every year. And then out in the back section here, I've already put in some uh, Roma tomatoes, but we don't need to go back there. Everybody knows what Roma tomatoes look like. I don't want to sound like I'm preaching to the choir, so. And then we get this year we're going to put in, uh, we did some jalapenos before. So here's some, uh, as the trailer park boys call them, jalapenos. And we call them jalapeno. And then I also got some, some uh, Jet Star there. They're a, a hybrid. And then I uh, decided to do some of these banana hot peppers this year also. And then we have the Lemon Boy here. And that's a hybrid tomato plant. If you know what a hybrid is, it they designed it basically. So here's how, how we do all this stuff here. Um, so what I do is I put rocks down here. you got to give everything proper drainage, okay? And then what I do is I take some of this gardener's felt and I'll throw that in there like so. And then I'll, I like to use the black toppers. It's actually manufactured from a lot of uh, composted material because it's uh, composted, uh, like it's certified organic composted material. So I really like using this stuff here. This uh, black container we got here, we found that in the field, on the edge of the field when we were deer hunting last year, and I thought, wow, what a nice container, I'm not leaving it in there, and I thought, free, and it was probably used at one time for growing cannabis. It's very common in the bush, you see a lot of those black containers. Well, cannabis is legal in Canada, so. Now they don't have to grow it and hide it in a some other person's property. So what I do is I just take it and go like this and I'll fill this right up. Now you're going to use all of it. Put some head space so that the water doesn't run over the side. Um, I, used to, I like to use a lot of my patio here to do plants and stuff. So, so I'll just put them in like that and then what we'll do is we'll uh, take this uh, we'll plant plant this mortgage lifter first and it's a high uh, I mean an heirloom tomato I always keep the tags and then uh, these I usually don't keep but this one there there you go done deal she'll be there for the summer uh, this this one here actually folks so you know has been known to grow tomatoes up in four pounds in size so that one's done now will you put in the lemon boy Another easy one. I, I put this dirt in this one yesterday. Another container somebody gave me. And, uh, and I've had it since. I'm, be gentle with them. But I'm not too rough with the plants. And then what will happen here next is I'll put a nice big tomato cage on it like this. Because these will grow really big here. But yeah, that's a little thing you can know about heirloom tomatoes, folks. Is that when you get these heirloom tomatoes, you can get the seed out of it dry them out and uh, put them away you know in case we have the proverbial shit hits the fan and you're gonna need it right and you're gonna wish you had these seeds or you can start your own next year via greenhouse or whatever remember that about heirlooms all right I hope this helps everybody out don't forget to subscribe like and share Terry Prepper out